Hey guys, it's Dennis here with Team Deberu, and in today's video, we're gonna create another Watch Me Build campaign with Max Bounty Affiliate Network, but this time using Facebook traffic. And before we jump into the content, if you are not a member of AFK Forum, you can click the link below into the description. So let's jump into the content. Hey guys and welcome back. Uh, in today's video, we're gonna create a Watch Me Build campaign with a Max Bounty Affiliate Network using Facebook traffic. So we're gonna go with news feed. So here we are inside the Max Bounty dashboard, like always on the search campaign section. And I have already choose the offer, which is gonna be in United Kingdom and it is a 500 pound JD Sports gift card. So let's have a look to the offer. So let's click it up here. So this is the offer. So win a 500 pound JD Sports gift card and it is in United Kingdom. So it is a single opt-in and the payout is $1.10 per lead. So if we look the description, we have a uh, users must be 25 plus so we need to be careful when we're gonna select the age so we're gonna go uh, 25 plus because under is not allowed it so anything else here so daily cap it is 300 actions per day maybe you can put a note about that and that's pretty much it so we're gonna come back uh, to here to grab our affiliate link later on. So we're gonna click here on uh, build tracking link. And now let's have a look at the offer landing page, which is looking like that. So this offer has a one question survey, which is still fine with our click funnels survey template. But what you can do here, you can ask your affiliate manager to give you the deep link. So that's mean that you're gonna pass this first survey one question site and you're gonna go straight away to the submit page, which is this one here. So if we click yes, so we're gonna go to the submit page and this is exactly how it's gonna look. So if you can get the deep link for this offer, so you're gonna send your traffic directly to this page and pass the one question survey from the advertiser. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna create our lender like always, then we're gonna go to the ads images and in the end, we're gonna create our Facebook campaign. So for lenders, we use our uh, ClickFunnel software. So let's jump into that right now and let's start changing the copy of the lender. So we're gonna use the Facebook template today because we're gonna drive traffic with Facebook. Uh, but anyway, we have Instagram uh, template and Facebook template. So the difference is just in questions. So Instagram two questions and Facebook has three questions. So let's go and jump inside the lender. So we're gonna click edit page and we're gonna edit the headline, the image, questions, answers, and we're gonna import our affiliate link from the Max Bounty uh, Network. All right, so here we are. I always like to go on mobile, looks better. So I have my copy ready for you, like always. So we're gonna grab the headline, which says, now you have a chance to win a JD Sports gift card worth 500 pound, which is congruent with the copy on the offer landing page. So we're gonna grab this one here, copy, and we're gonna paste it up here, like that. And we're gonna save. And next one, if you would like to, you can put the image or you can skip uh, this part so you're gonna just click here, delete, and it's gonna delete this element. But we're gonna put the image I have already done, which is this one here. So JD Sports logo, but here you can go with the brand logo 
with a white background so it doesn't need to be uh, actually the front uh, image of the store so you can put whatever you want so let's click here and let's change the questions and answers so we have three questions so let's go to the first one so the first question is where are you from just a basic question at the beginning and we're gonna go United Kingdom oh, Kingdom Ireland and then I have put Netherlands yeah, correct let's put Netherlands and the fourth answer it's always other like that all right let's go to the second one so second question it's gonna be more related to the uh, offer right so what is your favorite sport store all right so let's go with the first one which is our jd sports like that Sports Direct is the second one. Lily Whites, which apparently it's popular in UK. And other. All right, and the last question, it's gonna be what would you buy if you won? Just to bring a little bit of more uh, emotions, they start to think what they're gonna buy. Oh, sorry. Here was clothes. Clothing. Like that. Alright, and accessories. And other. Alright, so we have done with questions and answers. So let's go back and let's save. Looks like that I have missed one. Let's fix this one. Which one was? Ah, oh, yeah, Netherlands. Doesn't want to cooperate. Alright. Netherlands let's go back and let's save okay so we have our headline image questions and answers let's copy here and we're gonna update our SEO metadata up here like that and save and the last thing we need to do we're gonna go to max bounty affiliate network and we're gonna click build tracking link, social, raw link, and we're gonna copy our affiliate link. We're gonna go back and we're gonna click up here, edit survey options, outcomes, and custom redirect. We're gonna paste our affiliate link and we're gonna save it. So now we have done all the steps for the lender. So headline, image, questions, answers, and affiliate link, plus the SEO metadata. So now we can go back, so click exit. And here I always just point this out, just make sure uh, inside the settings uh, section, you have your Facebook pixel code. So up here head tracking code you're gonna just paste it up here inside and then go all the way down and click save and update settings all right so let's go let's go back to the template so the first step is done the next step is gonna be to find some images so we're gonna go to Google and you're gonna just type the brand for the offer so that's mean it's gonna be JD sports so let's go up here 
and this is the search bar where I have put JD Sports and now we're gonna just scroll down and find images like front store images inside the stores uh, shopping bags uh, customers inside the store uh, maybe even if you can find uh, that the customers are paying for goods so if we go down so you have a lot of images uh, storefront so this one is cool this one look at this one so it is inside the store and she's holding a JD Sports shopping bag which is perfect so you can use this kind of images but I have already prepared uh, I think eight examples to show you so uh, we're gonna jump there but you're gonna go and scroll down and let's say that you like this image up here let's find it again with that shopping bag and if you click it here it's gonna give you similar other images and then you can just scroll down here on the right side and try to find some similar images that this one here on the top right so let's have a look to this one see and then you have another one here so that's how you're gonna play it's gonna take some time to find good images but it is a really important task so let's jump to the Canva. So we use Canva to create our images. So this is a 1080 by 1080 dimensions for a Facebook newsfeed traffic. So we use a border around the images that the image stands out and it is a pattern interrupt for the visitor or watcher that scroll down the newsfeed on their uh, Facebook, right? So here are eight images, so slightly different ones. So the first one is inside the store, so you can use these images. So the second one is really cool one. It is a front store image, which you can see that uh, it is a JD logo and three guys that looks like that they have won that 500 pounds, which is pretty cool. So this, this image is really good one. So the third one is front store with actually people and visitors, which is not just a stock brand uh, storefront image like this one here, the sixth one. So the difference is that here you have people and here you don't have anybody, right? So it's two different uh, images. So the fourth one is some kind of promotion in the front of the store. So again, similar, but slightly different. So the fifth one and the sixth one, they are actually the same one. So front store with uh, visitors. And then we have two more, which are slightly different again. So again, store front image. And the last eight image is, uh, I just found this uh, cool image because right now is September and it's saying JD opening October. So it is related to this month, so September. So this could actually uh, mean that the store is actually opening in October. So they are giving away 500 pound uh, gift cards. So it is a slightly different angle, but absolutely worth to uh, test it and try if it's gonna work. So you never know which image it's gonna work, so you need to test it. So that's why we always say to have five to 10 images within uh, your ad set. So you can go five, six images, which is uh, fine for starting. And then when you have bigger budgets, you can put more images within your ad sets. All right, so right now we have the lender, we have the images, and now we're gonna go to ads manager and we're gonna create our campaign. So let's click it up here. And like always, we choose the traffic objective for our campaigns. And we're gonna go here, so campaign name, we're gonna put UK for United Kingdom. And then we're gonna put JD Sports for the brand. You can put your ID, I always do. I don't know why, but 
it's easier to find the offer. So let's go back like that and we're gonna put Facebook for uh, traffic. So it's not gonna be Instagram stories for IG, it's gonna be FB for Facebook. So click continue. For ad set name, we're gonna go again UK and F for females 18 to 65 and we're gonna probably target JD Sports. So let's have a look what we're gonna find out. So first we're gonna change the country United Kingdom which is up here. All right, so let's change the placements. So we go on mobile always. And now we're gonna deselect everything except the Facebook and double check everything here below. So deselect both of these ones and we use just Facebook news feed and all of these ones here we need to deselect like that all right let's have a look again so facebook mobile and facebook news feed perfect okay let's go back up and let's have a look for the interest so jd sports should come up yes it is let's have a look what we're gonna get so 4 million potential reach which is a lot let's have a look for females we still have 2 million so here depends of your daily budget but we go three times by payout so what you can do here you can split the age groups so you're gonna go 25 because we can't go below 25 right so 25 to 34 let's have a look what we're gonna get 760 perfect so you can do by age group so you're gonna have different ad sets so you can test females by age groups targeting JD sports so which is pretty good so then you're gonna go up here and you're gonna put 25 to 34 so you know that it is females 25 34 and targeting JD sports and you can test females first and then do exactly the same and target men's by age groups so you're gonna have minimum of six uh, ad sets Okay, so let's go down and let's finish the ad set level. So we always go with landing page views for optimization for ad delivery. And we need to choose our daily budget. So we go three times the payout, so 1.10. So that's mean it's gonna be, so 3.3 dollars. .3. So let's go back inside the ads manager. And we're gonna go 3.3. Okay, I'm gonna set the start date for tomorrow AM Like that All right, and now let's go continue to the ad level All right, so here on the let level we're gonna change the name first or you can leave it like that But I always go at set number one And here you're gonna choose your Facebook page that it's gonna be congruent with your offer. Okay, so let's upload our images. So we're gonna click here, upload images. And we're gonna grab all eight images for today's tutorial. All right, the images are here. So the next thing we need to add our copy. So it's gonna be primary text headline and then in the end we're gonna do here a display link so let's do this now let's go www so here you can put your facebook page name uh, slash the jd sport so facebook name 
jdsport like that all right and let's go to our copy and we're gonna click here and copy so are you a fan of jd sports we are giving away 500 pound gift cards click below to participate today so this is gonna be the primary text which we're gonna paste exactly here and then we're gonna grab the headline which is gonna say click here to participate so that it's congruent with the primary text so like here copy and headline like that and now we're gonna grab a couple emojis from up here so let's do this ones we're gonna put it up here and then we're gonna go back and we're gonna put this finger pointing straight to the right side where they need to click it so like that and if you want you can put another emoji just at the start of the copy so you can go with something around sports so you have a lot of here options to choose from uh, we can go let's go let's go up here if we have some shoes let's go with the shoes one this one all right so this is our ad so are you a fan of jd sports we are giving away 500 pound gift card click below to participate today and on the bottom you have your display link so and the headline which says click here to participate pointing to the button where it says learn more all right so let's have a look to the images Okay, the third one that's the inside the store so that's why it's always good to have uh, different images uh, to test it and see what works okay and the last one So six images and the very last thing we need to do we need to grab our lender URL so let's go to click funnels and Facebook template which is this one here and we're gonna copy our lender URL like that and we're gonna go back to ads manager and where it says website URL we're gonna click it here paste it and that's it okay so make sure to uh, connect your Facebook pixel here so you are supposed to have a green check here so double check that one before you click confirm all right guys so this would be pretty much everything uh, for today's video hope you got some value from it and if you have any additional questions like always you can just type it below into the comment section and if you enjoyed the video, please give us a like by clicking the button below. So thank you for watching and see you tomorrow with a new video. Are you struggling with your affiliate marketing business or want to take things to the next level? Allow me to introduce you to Dice University. Dice University is the number one affiliate marketing training platform in the world. Whether you're a beginner or an advanced affiliate marketer, Dice University offers you thousands of different videos with topics such as Facebook, volume, adplexity, and many more of your favorite topics. Step by step, you will learn the secret super affiliate ways to get the most out of each traffic source. Dominate each vertical with our detailed quick start guides. Are you ready to get started? Click the link in the description to sign up today.